But yeah, um, I also spilled some on my, 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 my screen, so that's why there are there little marks there. I swear it's not cum. <laughs> I swear. It's just chocolate milk, please trust I mean, me. You can... It's Glitter Mint Grove time. We're playing it. Yep, two goon playing Glitter Mint Grove. Yep. Aiden's still playing. I have not I have not played a game in a while. <laughs> yeah, I took over. I decided I'm he's, better at it. He's now goon number one. Oh, is that is that do you get that title when when you when you play the games? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So when I play games, I'm goon number one, and you're goon number uh, one thousand nine hundred twenty-seven. And then when you play games, you're goon number one, and I'm goon number two. <laughs> you see that? You see how it works? No. I thought we would reverse roles, John. That's that's yeah. the logical. I mean, you're goon number one right now, and I'm goon number two. But what about when you're playing, John? Then I'm goon number one, and you're goon number 1,927. But, John, that just doesn't add up. Mm, yeah, it does. No, it doesn't. You're just... The point is, when you're not playing, you're not the primary goon, okay? Okay, fine. All no, right. fine, fine, fine. You're you're primary the goons, they're not primary goons. <laughs> the prime numbers, the not prime numbers. Actually, that reminds me um, of our... Sorry, this is just intro. This isn't even like a, a funny haha. Right, but I just remember you reminded me of the book that we had to read for um, literature. Yes, it was uh, a man who mistook his wife for a hat. The man who mistook his wife for a hat, and it was like a what is it? <sighs> like medical clinical tales. Yeah, 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 yeah. Things like that. It's um, there's there's a word for it, but I can't remember it. However, like there was because you said prime numbers, and I just remember there was a case where there, there were these two twins who couldn't do like basic mathematical you know, whatever, and they were uh, a little bit mentally deficient, seeing as this was a, like, a clinical whatever, with, you know, doctors, <laughs> people like, oh, you have dementia, that's, it was, it was that kind of stuff, it was mental stuff, and um, they couldn't do basic, like, mathematical things, like adding, subtracting, multiplying, dividing, but they would just generate six-digit prime numbers and tell them to each other, and then laugh at them. Like, they would giggle because, haha, that's a really cool number. And so the doctor, like, figured that out at some point. Started bringing... He, he brought this book of prime numbers over. Which, I'm not sure if you ever got to this part. Yeah, I read um, the whole thing. Did you? Yeah, yeah. Did you make sure to turn the book back in? Yes, we okay, did that. Okay, good, good. <laughs> like, I, I was, stole the book! I was really... Because they just had you do it while it was, um... Yeah. Because Quarantine messed a lot of stuff up. Anyway... The doctor brought over a bunch of, um, basically prime numbers in a book, and he started reading them off, and some of them were, like, seven-digit numbers, and the twins would, like, sit there and consider them, and then they would come up with another seven-digit prime number, right? And this would basically go on until he ran out of prime numbers, like, all the way up to, like, 11-digit prime numbers, and the twins just started listing off different numbers that weren't in the book, and just, just being like, haha, this is a really interesting I just I always thought that one was really interesting um I don't know why I started the episode with that like that's not you know setting the mood for anything but you know <laughs> if you want to know what I'm interested in there you go <laughs> you're inter <laughs> I'm interested you're interested in people who like prime numbers yep okay. if you like prime numbers man, hit me up <laughs> is that what you have on like your your dating profile yeah, my, pages my like, tinder like fan of prime numbers big fan of prime numbers prime if number if enthusiasts every prime number up to the 20 digits <laughs> we can't we can't be together i mean you can try but like you gotta work really hard <laughs> yeah it's gonna be like 20 me. times harder for you you know it's funny i actually don't know like i i always forget what a prime number is so like you're talking about it right now, but you don't even know. I I assume it's like it's like those numbers that that can't be divided. Can, yeah, yeah. You can other only than get by them itself. By itself and one, I think. Yeah. Everything. Being, yeah, but it, that's only for integers, right? Because technically, you could multiply anything by any irrational number and eventually get it. Right, like whole so, numbers. So yeah, okay. are integers the same as whole numbers? I don't know. I think they are. Obviously, we haven't been in school for a while. So <laughs> <laughs> I need another sparkle hot. Yeah. Oh, wait, that costs crystals? Are you kidding me? Does it? It does. Okay, so well, I'm gonna make sense. another sight orb. I, I'm just gonna say it. The fact that we can't see the ground right there is bothering me. 
This? <laughs> yes, that's like just our giant this hatch. Oh, no. Oh, shoot. We have 28 food right now. That's we, okay. That's uh, Well, we have even more now because she's bringing some over here. Heck yeah, I think it's like one food. Okay. Oh, your fairies are hungry right now, though. Or do they want to hibernate? Is that what they do? Do they hibernate? Oh, oh, that was wood. I have plenty of wood, so this isn't a problem. I don't build another one. I haven't put anything over there. I'll put, put two more, two more houses over here. There we go. Okay. Do fairies hibernate? This is a question y'all need to know. The answer to. Sleeping in a house. Okay. Oh, oh wait. These are these are all empty. Oh, Maybe yeah. I'll cancel these. Okay. Cause I mean, I think they can still perform. So I think, I think winter might be the time for mining. That makes sense. But do you think there are because you get plants? you get plenty of sparkles, huh? Do you think there are underground plants? Plants? Plants like like food plants. Oh. I don't know. Can you do um? Is it called like hydroponics? <laughs> In glitter mint grove. Please. Is there mod support for this game? Oh god, I would love that. Could I make all the, the fairies just PNGs of Garfield? <laughs> <laughs> oh man. I think that's 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 the beauty of PC gaming, is even if there isn't modding, there's modding. But like for each different color is a different JPEG. So like one of them sleeping Dude, in. Dude, you could have bed. normal as well. Yeah. What are and your thoughts on normal? I, oh, he's stupid. Yeah? God, yeah, man, I love lasagna. <laughs> <laughs> what am I doing? There we go. <laughs> okay, so actually, um, I think my mom is is a pretty big fan of Nerva, which of okay. course this is this is a very odd conversation and also a very odd thing that I know. Dripple seed. Dripple. Whoa! Look at that. Oh, let's see what dripple is. Dripple is a sturdy fruit bearing tree. It grows fruit only slowly. Plenty. Needs... All of these need plenty of sunlight. Hexagon. Plenty of sun. This one just grows wood. Produces lots of wood. Okay. Yeah. So that's that's interesting. Um, I mean, to be fair, you don't have... I kind of like... I was about to say you don't have a wood tree, and then I, I remembered, hey, literally every tree in this game is made of wood. Yeah. That's kind of the point of trees. Yeah, trees... Trees, trees in general like are made the, of wood. Trees like their wood. <laughs> yeah, I, I would say. <sighs> so I think... I think Winter is the time that we really want to focus on the underground. The, yeah, because we get spooky. plenty. We get the yeah. We get plenty of sparkles, and then um, there's not much else to do. Mm -hmm. Swift North has grown into a neighborhood. Oh wait, we already read that. Yeah, yeah. Okay, now it's gone. So we need twenty fairies. We have ten right now. Yeah. Interesting. So maybe we do want those houses. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. yep. So let me let me build those because we have the wood. For the houses? Um, yeah, like we have plenty. We're, we're 15, just gonna stick one in the tree. Might as well. We're not doing much over there. Okay. Let's see. I'm also going to. I think it's interesting to have seasons in a game like this. Because it, it does encourage you to do other things than stick to the overworld. Which yeah. is, of course, the main. I, I assume it's the main point of this. I mean, game. you kind of, you know, you need crystals for stuff. What is that? Yeah. Is that on your screen? That's on your screen. Oh yeah, uh, that actually reminds me of a quick story. What's which the I'm story? Not, I can't remember if I told this while we were playing Cluster Truck, but the story of the chocolate milk spill. <laughs> I don't think we talked about. I don't. That. I don't either. Um, it, it's very simple. One one night I was drinking chocolate milk at my desk, <laughs> and um, <laughs> which of course you, you know we're recording this at my home, so it makes sense for me to be drunk, drinking chocolate milk. Um, I don't even remember how this happened. I think I just hit my knee on something. Basically, I was holding a glass of chocolate milk and hit my knee. And oh, so, yes. of course, my hand flung chocolate milk everywhere. That is a lot of wood, homie. Yeah, we got a lot of wood. We can Just build all the, build all the houses you can. Houses and wood chips. Um, basically, I ended up spilling a lot of chocolate milk everywhere, including onto a keyboard, which I still have, actually directly in front of me. Um, is it just on the ground? Yes. Well, yeah, it's right here. Which, um... That's the one, huh? You can see the O and K keys oh, are still stuck down. They're just... They're just completely stuck. pressed. Yeah. Wow. Oh, uh, there's some that are really clicky. That's not one. F F5, F3, and F4 are still stuck as well. Oh. I'm trying to find all the clicky keys. Did you try, like, putting water in it? Is this no. the kind that can drain? Uh, no. It's... Rope. 
It's just an office keyboard, dude. Right. Well, I don't know. It might have holes, so you don't. But yeah, um, I also spilled some on my my, my my screen, so that's why there there are little marks there. I swear it's not cum. <laughs> I swear. It's just chocolate milk. Please trust I mean, me. You can. Okay, we're midwinter. Oh, we're getting we're getting low on food. We may. We... Oh no, midwinter. Midwinter. How do you know? It it came up with a thing right now. Okay, there. gotcha. Yeah, we're getting kind of close. Well, you're doing a lot better than you did last time. Yes, I made it to midwinter. And See, this is what I'm talking it. about. This is the, the the growth the fans are here for. I feel like that's just how you play the game, though. <laughs> that's that's how you experience a video game, John. You're right. We're experiencing it correctly, though. Okay. Yeah. See, there's no problem. I'm currently pressing every. Oh. Are you Shift. Are you still just messing? You're just gonna. What are you pressing down? Oh, what is that? I don't even know if that's a chocolate milk problem. Oh, that's 100% chocolate milk problem. Yeah, you think so? Yeah, this keyboard was exactly like that one. <laughs> Imagine being an IT guy and being like, yeah. <laughs> I diagnosed I've seen this keyboard. it plenty of times before. <laughs> this ain't my first chocolate milk rodeo. Definitely a chalky milk type of problem. Oh, man. I imagine that's pretty common. I imagine a lot of guys, a lot of guys just keep, you know. Chalky? Chalky milk. Honestly, if I could, I, I would have a mini fridge next to my desk. Oh, I thought you were going to say like a chocolate milk dispenser. That too, if I could have it next to my desk. Okay, so let's see. I'm going to spice it up. Yeah. Uh, Need some variation here. Let's see if that works very well. What the heck? Oh man, that was awful. That was atrocious. So how did spicing it up go for you? <laughs> Horribly. I thought it was going to go straight and then go into that. No. No. Oh, why is it? I don't want to put it split. Why not? Okay. Because I don't, I don't need to go that far. I'm literally just going right here, man. Well, you no, okay. I guess that's fair, yeah. Don't waste your sparkles. Oh, How did you miss oh that, my bro? Goodness. My god, you were so bad at Glitterman, bro. <sighs> Look. Jeez. Oh, check, check this. Yeah, you can snipe it. Can I snipe this that, chest? That 360, um... Yeah, Let's baby. Go. Give oh, me that. Nice. Ten. Ten oh, great. More wood. Just what I... Oh, we're out of food. <laughs> I definitely could have used some food there. <laughs> just put it out. I should stop. Uh, so, I, I do wonder, is there food in chests? Have, have you, you found gotten me? food out of chests before? There's some I have crystals right there. I haven't seen Oh, we're food. actually getting kind of full on them. So, my, so we want to make a sparkle hut then. Mm -hmm. I just... <laughs> kind of do you have a tree, lot of wood, so man? Yeah, we have a ton of wood. Uh, yeah, I would Why actually hold off. the sparkle hut? Oh, that tree just seems like you can stick anything there. Yeah. It's kind um, of you also might want to put a whole light thing over there, that way you don't outbalance the tree. Because look, at you're putting everything on the left side. Mm. So you I mean, it's a pretty pretty beefy looking tree from the looks of yeah, it. Yeah. Well, actually. Yeah, it's, it's probably fine. I mean, it's, it's it's fine for right now. It's I mean, we haven't had a tree fall over yet. That is a thing that can happen, isn't it? Maybe. I don't even re I don't remember. Mm. Frankly. Nobody's left yet. We still have all ten people. Well, yeah, but you do have zero food. Mm, look at me. I'm a little fairy. I carry the giant crystal. Oh, she's not too on my way, too. Oh. Outwardly cheerful. She's slowed. Well, she's slow. because she's carrying a giant diamond, John. Oh, it's like I, as big as her. wasn't sure if it was just, you know... Look at these fools just sitting around here. Look at her ocean flower fern. Okay, I mean, am I right? Are they three D or my? I think they're three D. Okay, I, I wasn't think sure. Because sure. like from from like that flying animation just looks yeah. actually like two D, but you know okay. building animation. We need to give them something to do. Let's see, they're gathering sparkles. The only, oh no, we're losing it. <laughs> you need a sight orb up here. I think no, I think that's fine. No, like. I don't know. Well, okay, well, let's see. I, obviously, they're they're gaining sparkles. We need to see if they're gonna come over here and grab them though. Yeah. <sighs> let's check out our residence. She's not. Home. Dabsy. That's what they used to call me Shut in up. seventh grade. Oh god. <laughs> Did you actually go through a phase of like furious yes. dabbing? It's hilarious. <laughs> At time, maybe. No, but, but it's stupid. It's so funny. Did I? Okay. So about the end, I think, no, I think it was like one of the last days of school in seventh grade. Mm -hmm. um, man, I hope we can make it through winter and not have anybody leave. If, if two or three people leave, it's fine. Um, so 
I think we were just doing a review in, in literature class or English or whatever they want to call it. Mm-hmm. And um, <laughs> it was, I think it, uh, we eventually split it up to uh, boys versus girls. And um, it, like she would ask a question, you just write the answer on the marker board and hold it up for her, like the, oh, little, yeah. the tiny ones. And um, uh, <laughs> you didn't get anything for doing good on this. No? No. You, you like sh- maybe it was like candy or something, huh? We made it to year three. Yes, There's we did it. That was, that was time for celebration. Nobody left either. Woo! Oh yeah, we made it through. Now food's coming back. We got we got both of these trees over here. That's true. Originally we only had like one for half the year. Mm-hmm. So we should be able to get a good amount of. Uh, Ooh. Ooh, yowzers. Look at them. It, it also seems to make the fruit grow faster as well. See, I don't. We need to spectate up here and see if. They're grabbing the sparkles from there. Mm-hmm. Um, so back to the story. We, I don't, I don't think we're really getting anything from this. So <laughs> we didn't care about winning. <laughs> so we, we would put stupid nonsensical answers and then furiously dab. <laughs> yeah. When we got it wrong, <laughs> it was the funniest. <laughs> I. Was it just like all the boys? Yeah, it was just boys on one side, girls on one side, and we wrote, like, Mountain Dew, and then she's like, the girls got it right, we're like, mm. <laughs> but God. yes! I, I, I love that. <laughs> was, I love that so much. She got so mad, she got incredibly Dude. angry, she's uh, like, you guys have to try, and you're like, what are you gonna do about it? <laughs> what do you do about it? Handcuff us, we should Yo, we got more people. That's... Okay, so you're at 10 right now. Or 13 right now. Mm-hmm. You're trying to get to 20. Right. Originally, I was saying we should build the palace now. But I'm thinking, probably going to want to build more food reserves before well, that. Right. That I, think, have enough food I think for... we need to be able to have 20 people in order to support a palace. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I honestly, I don't have personal experience with operating a palace. No? Believe it or not. Really? Yeah. Really? Never, never I figured done that. If all the people, out of all the people that I knew, yeah, I figured you would be the person who had operated palace. Well, when I, when I think of that, I think of like like a Barbie, like the the super duper big set that's like a hundred dollars that like everybody wants. You mean like like like, like the ones that are like three feet tall? Yeah, that like have eighty different doors and like slides like, my going. My like a like a sort of smaller version of that, mm-hmm. and I would always come into a room to play with it because I would like make my um. Well, G.I. Joe figurines. <laughs> I would make them fight in that, and then I would make them, like, crash through the doors and, and stuff like that. Honestly, that was really fun. I don't understand why people don't do that. Like, like if you think of a boy's toy, right? Mm-hmm. Sorry, a masculine toy. I don't want to be too... You know. Come on, John. You got a little bit of political here. Anyway, you think of, of a masculine toy. You think, um, like, you know, little action figures... But you never think of, like, a landscape for the action figures to be on. I mean... So, for... Like, there's no... there's no If you're making your two toys fight, right? You don't have anywhere yeah. for them to fight. You just gotta make them fight either in the air or on your carpet. And it's kind of... I mean, yeah. Because when you, when you think about it, I bet, like, the places that you go to... Or the toys that you get are, like, vehicles and weapons and, like, yeah. outposts, maybe. But never, like, a big old... I mean, there's, there's the bat cave, though. That's the one thing... That I think gets built. But that's like... I mean, one thing, man. Right. I and even then, like, not everyone wants to play with the Batcave. Really? Some people want to play, you know, in a, in a, in a giant uh, Barbie doll house. <laughs> <laughs> my... I remember one year, my sister... My parents got her a big-ish dollhouse. It wasn't a Barbie one, but it was just mm-hmm. like a dollhouse. But then there was like... It was like all this company. It was like the whole... It was like a whole set. So, my parents got her the house, and then mm-hmm. all of my family members got her, like, the accessories for the bedroom, the, you know, so, like, the, the actual family. people. Yeah, my Fish family, family, that was, like, her gift for that birthday was, um, was that dollhouse and all those things. And I thought that was a, I thought that was cool. They should make, they should make that for, for, like, like, dudes. Well, I mean, there's gotta be, right? Like, there's no way that... The only thing I could think of was, was like, Mega Bloks, or Legos and things like that. Like, I used to have the Halo Mega Bloks. 
Yeah. Right. Those were, by the way, those were sick. They're pretty... Those I, still I, are sick. They're, like... Right, I just like don't think had... Halo would work with Legos, because I like I like the joints, like, and it looks yeah. well. It doesn't... It's not Legos. They use mid blocks. That's, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. I don't think Master Chief would look very good in Lego form. Um, no, you're 100%. Well, I'm pretty sure there's a figure. We can look that up later. Um, <laughs> that mean, brings us to... Huh? I mean, they, you know, they made a brand deal with Megalox. Like, you can't be making Halo Did Legos. they? I think that's how it works. Right? Because, like, you see... You see um, Does that, like, limit you to not work with Lego stuff? Maybe. Like, as long as you're working with Mega Bloks. Listen, I'm just putting it out there. We'll take any deal with anybody. <laughs> Make us some Legos. We're going to get sponsored by Mega Bloks and Please. do reviews. Are we going to do toy reviews on this channel? I, oh, my God. <laughs> Did you know that Nickelodeon is, like, making the sort of, like, kids' YouTube content now? Like... They put yeah. bath bombs in water, and they're like, look, it has a Nickelodeon, like, Paw Patrol figure in it. Really? And, like, here's how you make this slime or this craft, but it's, like, slightly And this is airing on Nickelodeon. Well, I remember going to a friend's house, and his sister, it was, like, on the app. Like, their streaming oh, service. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Um, I, I, I don't like that, actually. No, I'm not a fan. I think... It was on Nick Jr. Nick Jr., okay. So... That makes more, like, if they did that on normal Nick, I'd be... Kind of sad. Yeah. It's my shot, bro. I don't know. And also, you know, I've seen... Oh, see, this is all shaded. We don't need this stupid branch here. Die. <laughs> Die. Die. You have outstayed your welcome. Hey, we're over here now. we got another... This tree this is a very is... sturdy tree. That is a very sturdy tree, isn't it? It's like oak or something. Holy cow, man. There you go. Um, I think it's probably about time to end this episode. Man! And I will be the one to say goodbye today. Well, I mean, I say goodbye too. It's not like... I mean, you can't, Yeah. It's, it's, so I'm just saying I'll start off the goodbye. Yeah, I want to, this, uh, does this need to be planned and organized? Do you think anybody's going to care? Just saying. Hmm. Offhanded comment about beating the shit out of you. Anyway. Um... <laughs> Thank you for watching the goons play Glittermitten Grove. It has been very fun playing this. Um, I think we'll probably only have like a couple more episodes of this. Yeah, we're not. I think we're. I think we're probably getting there. Getting to the palace. Hopefully, hopefully. But uh, this has been really fun. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you for tuning in. Yep. Goodbye. Bye bye. Hit the fucking button. Okay.